a new thing here we started at MIT, MIT that's very different from what I did for my PhD is we focus a lot more on the uh, machine learning part. Now, like a lot of autonomous system gets like uh, incredible development because of the development in machine learning and artificial intelligence. But people still see that machine learning as a black box system. We don't really know what will happen and you have a lot of concerns about you know, whether we should really use machine learning without understanding what's happening behind a machine learning algorithm. So at Realm here, what we started to do is we give every machine learning algorithm a proof. Uh, what we do is we sort of traditionally, if people use machine learning to, for example, help you drive your car, they just uh, find out how that policy that's going to be uh, they are going to learn just a policy to drive the car. But here, instead of using machine learning just to learn what to do, we also learn why you want to do that. So instead of just learning the policy, we jointly learn a policy and the proof. This proof, it's, it's sort of a evidence for whatever you want to achieve, what can be achieved. Now our policy is learn not just to improve some empirical performance. Our policy is learn to make sure there always exists a proof for the overall system to satisfy properties like safety or you know some other systematic uh, system specifications that you you want it to to satisfy. So that's something new we're doing here. We're very very excited about it. The how part is the policy. Like you have a system autonomous system, you want to find a policy that drive the system to move autonomously. The why part is the certificate. With what you call the certificate. The certificate is basically a mathematical description or a mathematical sort of group of mathematical equations you can imagine to, um, to from the from a mathematical aspect to to show you here is um, the property that you want and why it will set, be satisfied if we are use this policy this is the why part so for us we are sort of bringing um, formal methods and control together with machine learning to to actually sort of advance both parts. We use machine learning to make formal methods of control much more powerful, much more expressive. And we use formal methods and control to make sure these machine learning uh, techniques we're using is certified. Now, using this kind of approach, what we get is like two parts. We have a policy that's, a, that's like sort of neural network kind of thing. We also have a proof that's also a neural network, but this neural network is serving as the purpose of First of all, certifying your policy is always correct. And we can visualize this certificate to see why the autonomous system chose to, that, to do that action. For example, when in, in one of our example, we have this um, uh, car moving across a crowded intersection with a lot of pedestrians. We can visualize from the car's aspect why the car chose to move slowly instead of stopping there or why it think like uh, what kind of confidence it has to make sure it won't collide with the pedestrian but also being able to make some progress instead of st being stuck there you know nowadays in a lot of problem of self-driving is not being too dangerous it's actually being too conservative uh, you want, always want to achieve a good trade-off between safety and drivability you don't want your you know the, the safest way just to st stop there but we don't want to uh, sort of sacrifice uh, drivability or sacrifice like progress just for safety and using the certificates you have have a really good understanding of why this action is chosen what kind of guarantee we can have by choosing that action now um, you, like they sort of enable this bi-directional understanding between the uh, between the like user human human being and the autonomous agents they understand what each other are doing so that's like the the why parts so and I'm really excited about this like um, this inter inter this interdisciplinary area of bringing um, machine learning and the rigorous methods that we use to work on.